people of Alberta have had a rough few years. They're having a hard time making ends meet, and they're nervous for what comes next. For many people in this province, they don't know what their next job looks like or when they're going to find it. I want you to know that I feel that frustration, and I understand that anxiety. The status quo cannot continue. The drop in oil prices have left many, many people around here without jobs. As a country, we're still fighting a decade-long struggle to build pipelines to non-U.S. markets. The price differential on Alberta oil is a real problem. Because we're forced to sell our oil at a discount, Canada's economy is losing an estimated $80 million a day. As Canada continues to face its painful discount on oil, we're very, very aware of how crucial TMX is to our country. It has enormous strategic importance. Right now, 99% of our oil goes to a single market, the United States. I think we can all agree that that both represents a risk and makes no economic sense. We need to get our resources to new markets, plain and simple. That's why our government made the decision to buy the pipeline and its proposed expansion but we also realize that a project of this size must be assessed properly. And that's exactly what the courts instructed us to do. My government is committed to moving forward through meaningful consultations in a way that works for both communities and businesses. Not just because it's the right way, but because it's the only way.